My biggest regret, um, I would say, is um, not having nurtured myself as much as I do now for the years that preceded all this. Mm. Yeah, I hadn't arrived at this place. Not that it's ever too late, because I don't believe that it's ever too late, but it's just um, there's a good time for everything, and I guess this is my time. I'm not. I'm making up for lost time, in other words. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's oh, I'm making good. you that laugh. That's good. a good thing. You have a very deep soul. That's that's very interesting. Thank you for the answer. You're welcome. I'm loving every minute. You should get my book. You'll love it. Is it available via PayPal or what? Because I just took yes, it. it is on Amazon. Okay, excellent. And if he would like to meet you in person yes, on Saturday. Yes, you can Saturday. meet me in person. Would you plan? Oh, <laughs> do you I'd plan to do a, like an audio reading? An yeah. audio reading. Yeah, you know, it's like uh, you would read a book, set it to music or something like that. You'd probably pretty, you know, clean up pretty good with that. Well, I might not do it to music because that sort of, you know, there, it would have to be orchestrated exactly the way I would like it because I'm very sensitive. But I am thinking of doing an audio component to my book. Well, there you go then. Mm-hmm. Oh, why do you do audio? Well, um, I do I do web design, graphic design. It's just you know because I like listening to audio books on my MP3 player while I'm walking about, you know. Oh, okay. No, mine would be definitely a perfect accompaniment to my writing. Oh, excellent. Especially if I'm the one reading it. <laughs> if you know what I mean. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got my drift, baby. <laughs> well, thank you for the answer, Nancy. You take care. Thank everyone. you. And who we uh, who are you? What's your name? Oh, by the way, yeah, that's right. I'm sorry, Gabriel. Gabriel, Gabriel that's and a where are you from? Name. I'm from Flesh and Queen. Okay, Gabriel. Okay. Thank you so much for calling. Yes, thank you, Gabriel, and the best of everything. Do you have a website or an address? I have my contact. Uh, I have SusanPicosa.com. That is the website. It's, I designed it. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's very deco, decadent and deco. <laughs> <laughs> it's a deck. What is it again? Susan P? P-I-C-O-S-A. P-I-C-O-S-A. C is in... Yes, C O S A. S A. Susan Picasso. It's right up there on the Dot screen. Com. Yes. yes. Thank you very much. Thank You're you so much for calling. Have a good calling. night. Good night, Gabriel. Bye. <laughs> very sweet man. Very nice. Yes. Very nice. He that had was a, great a good voice question. Too. Yes, he does. He does. A yes, it was an excellent question. It was because regrets are not. I don't really have regrets about things in my life. Actually, I go forward. I. I, I forgive myself for things, you know. Exactly, and and the times you had a lot of good memories, and you would think of all the good memories you had. I mean, because it's not a total, it's not totally bad memories. Everything. No. So I would always think of the good memories and forget the bad. Yes, and also to tell you the truth, um, even in the book, there were some experiences that I had that were really uh, not the greatest, but they were experiences, and they added to the dimensions of my life. And then I can really process it in a way that lets me see, am I interested in that again, or do I select something else for myself? And that's a very big deal when you evaluate like that and move on. You don't have to um, feel that you've done a negative situation with anyone, but... Um, uh, so it's good. You're always positive. That's great. Yes, very positive. Very I'm, good. I'm never angry. I very rarely get angry. I noticed that. You're always yeah. pleasant and a yeah. good mood. I mean, yeah, it yeah. makes you, ha you have a great smile, which Thank you do you. talk about that, too, in the book, I think. Yes, 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 yes. that's true. And so you have some more steamy, yeah, steamy, steamy. reading? I just must say that there were times when I've shared what I've written before I've published it, and um, at the time, uh, I had some 
critique from friends of mine, one in particular, that said um, she doesn't like my choice of words for the body parts. Oh, now that that was okay. like, and that she's not a, a nun or anything. <laughs> I mean, she's not. She wasn't comfortable with the words that you chose. She never would use these words when she's making love. Okay, we have a phone caller. Hi, uh -huh. phone caller. Oh, hi. How you doing? Okay, who are we talking to? Uh, my name is Linda. I'm from Westchester. Hello, Linda. Hi, Linda. Hi. Hi. Hi, Susan. I just wanted to call and tell you I have bought your book, <gasps> and it's very sensual. I just loved it. I couldn't put it down. Oh, I love that, it's Linda. Terrific. What? You no, know, the problem now is like you're not on my screen. I'm on the internet, and you're not on there anymore. Maybe you can. Oh, I don't know. She she said she's on the internet, but sometimes that happens. Really? Refresh the screen. That's what someone just said. Joey said refresh it. Uh, all right. But I just wanted to tell you I loved your book. Okay. And um, that's all. It was just really good. I love that. I love that. Okay. Have a beautiful night, Linda. Thank you, dear. Okay. Bye, Bye. sweetheart. Nice talking to you. Bye. Nice talking to you directly. I love it. Bye, honey. Bye. Refresh the screen. <laughs> <laughs> that was nice. Yeah, Wonderful. that was really nice. Chester. Yeah, that was great. Very mm -hmm. good. Word is spreading, isn't it? Yes, absolutely. Yes. Especially on the internet. Now. Yeah, that's it's so not great. Just the newspaper. No, 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 no. No, it's internet like the internet. Goes a long cyberspace, way. baby. Cyberspace. Yes. So anyway, this word. There were two words there. She didn't like the word cock, and she didn't like the word pussy. She didn't like any words like that. So. That's my choice of words. I'm not going to say penis, and I'm not going to say vagina, and I'm not going to say private parts. That's not how I wrote. You know, these are words that are comfortable for these me. These are your feelings within. Yeah, the, passionate the, your when we're talking. You know, when we're when yeah. we're sharing in the moment. Sharing. Um, and I know that she just said she just didn't like it. So I said, okay, it's okay. And it's her choice. It's her choice. Something it for is everyone. Her choice. Some people, right, exactly. Live well, and let live, as I said before. Some people you know? don't like the book. You know the words yeah. that you chose. Yeah, she was the only one that really, you know. But I mean, in real life, it's that's what it is. Yeah, yeah. Men it's like you know, it, it's evolved to that place for me. You know, maybe initially you could say vagina, penis, and everything, and then as you grow up, it's like. You know, or maybe when so you're it was younger. a dirty book for her. It yeah. Rated X. <laughs> rated X, and you know, but she's sort of reading it little of, by little. But maybe she'll change her thoughts at some point, and um, it's hopefully, possible. She, and if not, it's okay. It's okay, right? I, I know her she's well. Allowed. She's a good friend. Yes. All right. Let me see here. Um, and you have some steamy. Sizzling nights in there that I read. Yes, Lots there of were um, so many. I met a hotter than hot police officer, Mr. Jesse Caliente, meaning hot anyway, <laughs> when he was waiting on horseback as he was observing the goings on with traffic activities and such in the downtown area of the big city. I was waiting at the shuttle bus stop for a guest to arrive from Europe at that time. He was perched on his stallion like he would later perch on me and I couldn't help noticing the beautiful muscles showing in his legs. My eyes devoured the sight from his boots in the stirrups all the way up to his toned, muscular hips. There was a sizzling undercurrent of sexual tension between us from the first step in his direction. I knew I wanted to have him, and you guessed right, I did. <laughs> You got all these sexy oh, yeah. feathers. That wow. is something. Yes, these feathers here. Let yeah. me just show you. The, the, these they're, can they're be used very, uh, in different ways, in yeah, different body tease, areas. You yeah. know, like to tease and play and just feel really good. I know. Oh, I to it. tickle. Yeah. yeah, it feels good. Could be fun. Yeah. yeah. Fun, fun and soft. Lots they're, of fun. You're in my bedroom in different vases. And that's how I welcome my guests into my boudoir at times. Like, come here, come yeah. here, come here, come here, come here, there. Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was cute. I mean, yeah, you have to think of different things to do. Yes, there's something very interesting. There's a story that I have here. There are a few things where I did explorations, and the explorations were the um, the shops that have vibrators and lingerie and everything in the city. 
So I went, I thought I'm a big girl now at 70. Well, I was maybe 68 <laughs> then. I said, uh, I am going to go and see about some tapes. At that point, I, I thought tapes, not CDs, because I was back in the day in my right, head. And I hadn't progressed. Nice. I hadn't progressed as yet. I had grown up exactly. So I said, but I'm entitled. I can do that. So I went into one of them, and I said, I'm doing a project at school on masturbation. So the guy that was up at the, <laughs> he's like raised up there. He said, OK, masturbation CDs. Uh, aisle number five. Aisle number five. <laughs> Talking about masturbation. Yes. Okay. But we do have a phone call. Oh, another Hi, caller. phone caller. Hi, Nancy. How are you doing? Hi. How are you? Who's this? My name is Myra, and I watch you, and I just want to say that I love you. And as for the writer, I cannot wait to get her book. Oh, Hi, I love Myra. It. Myra, where do you live? I live in Queens. Well, would you be coming on Saturday? Um, I don't know. I've never. I, I've always watched you, but I've never gone to your show. Why not? I don't. Cause I'm come, married. Oh, come on. Because I why, you. Myra? <laughs> why, my why husband my, won't let me. What What did you say? Why? My My husband. He won't let me. But. You can bring him. Oh, yeah, sure, I wish. <laughs> Why not? It's a book signing and then an after party, some music. Okay, I'll, I'll talk to him about it. Yeah, it's going to be at Blaggett's, and we're at Late 8 West 38 between 5th and 6th. I mean, it's a nice little pub. Um, it's harmless. 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 You'll be with him. <laughs> Yeah, she's going to ask her husband. Okay, she's going to ask him. But that was nice. Thank you, Myra, yes, for yes, calling. Thank you. Yeah, so getting back to tickling and... and tickling and, and... So that was one situation. Then I decided uh, there was a another shop in an area that I lived near. Is that another Do we have call? a phone caller? Hi, phone caller. Hi, Nancy. How are you? Who's this? This is Janie. How are you doing, Mama? Janie? Yep. Hi, Janie. How are you? I'm good, thanks. How are you guys doing? I'm all right. I'm sitting here with Susan. She wrote a book, and uh, it's Bedtime Stories, and she brought these fabulous feathers. I know. I'm, I'm watching it on the Internet. Oh, I know. Oh, yeah. Aren't they great? She's got these yeah. beautiful feathers, and she's got white, and she's got a big red one. How well, you I'm been? I'm allergic to feathers, so it's not my thing, you know. Okay. Hey, well, whatever. when are you coming back on the show? Hopefully next month. Inshallah, we'll see. Yeah? Yeah. You know, I would yeah. love for you to perform at Goddesses. <laughs> oh, you're a performer, Nancy. Jeannie, yeah. No, Jeannie, no, Jeannie. What the kids want to see is you perform, Nancy. That's what they want to see. They want to see me perform? Absolutely. Oh, you know, I hope you feel better. I heard about that foot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. What right were you now. doing? Were you doing some wild sex or something? <laughs> mm. Nancy, if I was doing wild sex, I wouldn't reveal it on TV, but I'll wait for it to put it on a book. Ah, okay. You would write about it. Well, yeah, <laughs> I would. Nancy, <laughs> when is your book coming out? Those are some stories I'm dying to listen to. I know. I'd, I'd probably be too embarrassed to write it while I'll help I'm alive. You. I'll be your, uh... I don't know. Nancy, that's how people learn. It would be incriminating a lot of people involved. No, name Especially no. myself. Listen, if, you can, if there's a little girl that can take the Pentagon down, Nancy, I'm afraid <laughs> what you can do. I probably have to do it with audio. I, I, I don't like writing. I have to, like, word it out, put it on a CD. Whatever works, Mama, whatever works. Yeah, but uh, well, I really, really hope you get well. And, um, thank you. I hope to see you soon and, and yes, get around. Sure. I know we were I supposed will. to do some shows together, but, um, well, perhaps in 2013. Absolutely. I hope you're... Onwards. I hope you get better soon. And, and Thanks, Emma. Yeah, I wish thank you well. Thank you. Miss I wish you. you well. Take care, everyone. Thank Bye, you. sweetheart. That was Bye -bye. Janie. Janie. Janie Martinez. She's an actress. Oh, really? Oh, yes. She's wonderful. Very talented. By the way, oh. I have a gift, my darling, for oh, you. Oh, you do? Thank you. It's a perfume. It's by... Robert Piguet. It's called oh. Fraca, and it's my signature fragrance. Oh, thank you so much. You can open it, but in in the book, um, his name it. is... Oh, of course, darling. Oh, we do have another, another phone call. caller. 
Hello, phone caller. Hey, Nancy, how are you? Who are you? I'm Tony, how are you? Hi, Tony, where are you Hi, calling Tony. from, Tony? I'm calling from Ozone Park. How are you? I'm doing very well, yourself? Okay, so would you want to come to the party Saturday? Well, I tell you, I'm a really big fan of your show. I've been watching the show now for the past 10 years on TV, actually. Wow, and we and we never met, and you never came to the studio, Tony. No, I never came to the studio. I'm actually a fitness model, and I just wanted to call up and say hi, because I've been watching you for 10 years, and I uh, just can't believe you're still on TV. It's great. Wow, thank you. It's been quite a while. Yeah, you have a fantastic show. You have great guests on there, and, and you're really doing a good thing, and God bless you. Thank you, Tony. Thank you, Tony. All right, have a great night. You Thank too. You. Very sweet. Very nice person. Yes. So you well, guys By the way, the company is by Robert Piguet. Oh, and, and it's a and perfume. This and is this the, is the perfume. perfume you just gave me? Yes. And oh, this wow. is something that... Pretty bottle. That, oh, it's so beautiful. And because oh, it I'm, smells very lovely. Yes. Very nice. People know me by this signature fragrance. And therefore, I represent the company now in different ways because of the mention. Oh, great. So... It's all available so through you, my you're website. Talented. You're very and my, talented. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Perfume and a yeah, book I can, and clothes uh, uh, and uh, uh, smelling good and tickling yeah, 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 your yeah. partner. Yes. Having some fun in the bedroom. Yes, definitely. Candles, fun in the bedroom. Scent not scented only the candles. bedroom. Not only the bedroom, my darling. In places right. yes. that can you're I not supposed to more? be doing it in, right? Well, they're there. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> exactly. You know, outside in the snow, against the car, oh, really? with hot muffins. So did you do it in the snow? Yes, I'll tell you about this in a minute. Well, you yeah. can just say it on the top of your head. You can I can? Just, okay. Yeah, you don't even have to I, read it. You well, can just talk way, about your experience. All right, all right, all right. That's in the book. It'd be more okay. exciting. All right. Yeah. Well, um, there was one In the snow. Let's morning. The snow. Yeah, in, in the snow. <laughs> it was so fabulous. I met a lover of mine in the morning and we were going to have breakfast early like five o'clock and I had my car and I picked him up by his home and uh, I had brought these wonderful corn muffins dripping with hot hot butter and jelly just dripping okay. and coffee and we just said wow we can't miss this opportunity it was amazing the um, it was snowing around us and I didn't come with panties on intentionally and we just parked at a certain place, touching each other, eating the breakfast. Oh, but you didn't we go out take it on anymore. the snow? We went out on the snow. Wow. And we had sex And where out were there. your neighbors? There were no neighbors. <laughs> Who was up at 5 in the morning? Oh, okay. No, I and, hope and those now fences I, were pretty high. No, the snow was very high. Oh, was it? Yes, and it was secluded area. And this person has been in many situations with me that have been very his name is delicious <laughs> david in the book for anyone that wants to look at the book so you were melting the snow melting the snow and <laughs> we melted each other i mean he's an amazing lover and other times um i mean he's just amazing so i also so that's asked a new him, one for me in the snow i never tried that really yes Oh, it's wonderful. The contrast okay, of the cold, cold and the heat. That's a way to know? cool off, isn't yes, it? Yes, <laughs> yes. The body temperature is really burning up. And you would melt and right through. Melt right through. There's like a puddle of liquid when okay. you're done. Yeah, yeah. One thing I must say, in all my experiences, I've always practiced safe sex. Condoms are the that's thing. That's important, My yes. body is my temple, and I need to let people know that you can have a wonderful time, just fabulous time, and have all of these experiences, anything you want. Whatever floats your boat. I'm not into anything. Uh, That's not safe. Everything not safe. Is safe. And yes. also, I'm not into S and M and all this stuff. I'm more of a romantic, gentle person. Um, but like with know, the feathers, tickling like the feathers, and the feathers, teasing, yes, the feathers, showing you love. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Absolutely. And being loved like that too. Yeah, definitely. Yes. But um, yeah, there was one thing with uh, Delicious David that was very special where I I. Um, he said that I could photograph his body. Wow. Yeah, just like really photograph everything. And I did, and then I took it to a place to reproduce the images. And I had to drape my whole body over where the image would come out and make a selection on the camera. And then it comes out in the container down below. And so it was like a drape and shield kind of moment. So I'm the drape and shield uh, 
<laughs> Porn queen. <laughs> so right. I have those pictures. Oh, wonderful. And so he loves it. You, that is for your private collection? Is My private, private collection. Okay. And he loves that idea. And he sent me things from his private collection. Oh, very sweet. We're very open. Very, very nice. open with each other. I've known him for about 30 years. That's very sweet. Mm -hmm. And so... All There's no jealousy in any, any of no my relationships. None. None, none, none. Because I'm happy. I'm content. I'm satisfied. And when I see them, I see them. When I don't, that's the difference of where I am now from where I was. And women can really learn to not be the clinging vines that they were or feeling terrible feelings of disappointment. Because insecure. People insecure, basic be insecure. insecure, and feeling they're left with. Because there were a couple of instances in my book where there were men that disappointed me and I'll never get back there again because I don't have to. There are enough people that I can tap into when I want to and they can call me and we can be open with each other. Absolutely, and, it's cool. and, and people can read about it, yeah. Susan's Bedtime Stories, if you're just yes. tuning in. and Yes, absolutely. Wow, it's amazing. Yeah. So Saturday night, you're Saturday night. going to be at Goddesses at, at Blackers, Blackers, yes. and you're going to be doing a book signing? Yes, I am. It's going to be fabulous. A lot of people should in. just come in and yes. enjoy, and, yes. and I'll and, meet and them, and we'll talk, and absolutely. We'll, they can ask me anything they want, anything whatsoever. I'm open to all questions, honestly, I answered. Yes, because or that's my thing. they can call in now and ask a question. They can call in now, too. Yes, definitely. Wonderful. Yeah, but um, there were other experiences. There, CeeLo Green, the great CeeLo Green, he inspired me. One day I was driving along listening to um, a song called When Was the Last Time? Like, when <laughs> oh, was the last time? Oh, that's a good title. When yeah, was when was the last time? time you've been held? When was the last time you've, had, you've danced, really? And I, I was so inspired by this song that I pulled off to the side of the road. I cranked the music up and started moving and grooving right along my car, the side of my car. <laughs> People thought I'm crazy, but who cared? And um, like, who gives a damn? You know, that's what I'm doing. And I drove myself to a music store and I bought ankle bells and tambourines because it was a lot of percussive sound. I love CeeLo Green. So I wrote a dedication to him in the book that he inspired me so that he is the uh, lavender icing on my red velvet cake. And I told him that I'd like to meet him because I want to design for him. I've designed for many jazz greats, and he's one of them. And I said, you are red velvet, CeeLo. And How you sweet. are, baby. <laughs> Very sweet. Yeah. Is he watching you right now? I Do hope he is. And Does if he, he isn't, he's going to hear about me. Yes, you are, CeeLo. Yes. Well, yes, I hope are. everybody enjoyed this show tonight. And um, if they I don't have a it. book, maybe they can come and meet you on Saturday. Come, come, come. come <laughs> You'll be, to the you'll lover, be there for a couple the of hours. Yes, of course I will. And I'll, I get to meet you live. Yeah, it'll be my pleasure to be there. Absolutely. And share my stories. All my stories, you know, we can get into that. Absolutely. It'll be wonderful. I mean, there's so many steamy, I mean, I read so many stories in that book. They were amazing. And you just come out and say straight out. Yeah, like, whoop, out, no, out yeah. in there. <laughs> Someone here tonight asked me, is that the lady that wrote the book? <laughs> I couldn't believe it. <laughs> because they read a part in there because you used the word pussy. Yes, and, pussy, and, sweet uh, pussy. She was like, is that her? It is. <laughs> Wet pussy, sweet pussy, whatever. Yes, they were reading that segment yes, right that's there. True. Yeah, that's absolutely. true. Absolutely, yeah. Why not? You tell it like it is. But I love these feathers, and for men out there who like to get tickled, or women, yes. this is great. I have a it's feather contact also. It's not just massaging also. with oil. I have a feather contact also, so they can call me. Yes. Oh, very good. Yes, so the perfume, that, the satin sheets. Because I love feathers, and, and feathers are fun. And Would you like to open your gift? People, uh, yeah, absolutely. Why not? Yeah. I have a gift for you, but I'll have to give it to you Saturday. I have a goddess necklace for Oh, you. a goddess necklace? Yes. Oh, oh God, I really so be a goddess. Thank you so much. Oh, it's beautiful. Thank you so much. I love so you, Nancy. Much. Thank I love you. you. You're thank sweetheart. Thank you for being here tonight. Of course, of course. And I'm going to use this and yes, thank you. you and wear it well. We're going to. You'll love that fragrance. It's going to be. It precedes yeah, you when you walk into a room. Yes, the men. The men is like bees to honey, baby. Bees to honey. Yes. But yeah, you have to make um, your love life exciting. You do. Uh, do Candles. something different every day. Uh, massage each other, tickle each other, Absolutely. laugh. Absolutely, serve and, and each other food. Exactly. Food to in have your mouth, love. like little, 
little olives, little right. crackers so with things. Is there any other tips that you can give out there for women um, uh, and men to make the to enhance their love? I think you have romance? to sense what the woman is about and be sensitive to that. If she likes gentle, playful, uh, humorous moments, that's good. And also, and mentioned the woman to the man. Give attention. You need to be attentive. Be attention to each other and what their needs are. Yes, yes, it's and very it should be stay happy quality time yes. attention. Not with. The, uh, uh, excuse me. I have to go. I have to go. It's not like that. It has to be really. Even if it's a block no of five minutes, <laughs> but you can have a quickie besides that. But no, like five. <laughs> It could be a five-minute block of time and just <laughs> devote it to her or devote it to him. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much once again. I, You're I welcome, love the darling. book. The sheets My are book. sexy. The feathers are great for the bedroom thank and you. even out of the bedroom. Out of the bedroom. They're play. fun. Yes, they are. They're just so They're much fun. fun, and I hope the oh. men and women out there will get the book and, and maybe get some feathers and yes, have some they should. fun. They should get feathers. And some satin sheets so that they could slide on Satin it. sheets, beautiful candles, uh, yes. fragrance. And, and just enjoy yes, each other. A drink, a beautiful mimosa, something really pretty. Yeah, and that's what it's about, about being happy yes, with is. yourself and with your partner. Yes, it is. Absolutely. I'm happy with all of my partners, all of them. They've been very <laughs> good to me and well, I'm you're to single. Them. I am single and happy. now. I'm so happy. I'm viewers joyous. Out there, come and meet Susan inspired. on Saturday at Blaggards. I'll and be there. We both will be there. We will be there. And we're going to have a good time. We're going to enjoy this Saturday yes, night. Yes, really beautiful. And the weather's going to be great. Absolutely. So it's a good time to come out so everybody, before the thank holidays. Thank you for watching. And, and have a happy holiday. Yes, and have a, a happy holiday. One. You too. And sorry about what happened with the storm, but I hope everybody is safe yeah, out there now. Yeah. It's been rough, but this is healing now. They yes. can heal from this. Yes. And I hope everybody enjoyed the show. Please get the book and check us out on the yes, website. Yes, it's a great sto stocking I mean, I stuffer. It. A great stocking it is. stuffer. And, and be happy. Yeah. On who you are, no matter what size you are. No matter are. what. So don't forget, it's very no. important yes, to love yourself. Yes, Susan's Bedtime Stories is uh, now for the woman that is not a size two necessarily. It's for everyone. That's the only option that's not available. You know, size two, maybe, maybe not, but it's not <laughs> necessary. Well, we're size acceptance. We accept everybody exactly. no matter what size you are. And so mm -hmm. I wish everybody a happy and healthy. And thank yes. you again for coming thank here. Thank you, darling. Thank you so Love much. You. I enjoyed it. The flowers and, and the feathers and all the fun yes, here tonight. Yes, yes, yes. And the scents. I mean, your perfume is the fabulous. The perfume, when you go into a room now, <laughs> it'll be like people will know that you're there. Yeah. Lots and lots of feathers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Very nice. I love it. Beautiful. Feathers and flowers. Yeah. And, yes. Thank uh, you for watching, everybody. Pants. Bye.